It is narrated from Imams that Allah's mercy be upon those who keep our matters alive. They were asked how to keep our, your matters alive. He said, learn our words and teach it to people. Because people, when they hear our good words, they would follow us. It is a, a path for us to teach ourselves. And we are at a time where we are at the most of need to learn these akhlaq principles. From what has been relate, narrated from this Imam regarding being aware of worship and doing the best of deeds and not to allow the opportunities to be missed. Make sure that you, Allah will never see you somewhere committing a sin that he has pro prohibited on you and that he would not miss you from somewhere that he, you have been ordered to attend to do a worship. Be careful of excessive joking because it, it reduces your belief and your respect. Be aware of laziness and boredom because it prevents you from a lot of good in this world. The Imam warns us, warns his sons and, and us from committing sins which Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala has prohibited. Some people commit sins maybe because of their ignorance or because of the weakness of their fear from Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala or because of a confusion that they may go through in terms of understanding what is a sin, what is a disobedience. There has been numerous calls from the infallibles, the ma'sumin, that we must seek knowledge and understand religion and understand the rules and rulings of religion to be able to worship Allah and obey Allah in the right way.